Yes, yeah, so welcome back to a very special edition of ET Canada. I'm sitting down with my old friends. You don't, you're not offended. With the, I say how, old friends. How old are we? <laughs> well, you're a lot <laughs> younger old, than I am. <laughs> with my old friends. Is our relationship old or are we very old friends? <laughs> this half hour is old already. <laughs> this is like. Come on, I'm just joking. Get, get away from me. Get, oh, okay. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you get me back. Okay, so this leads right into this trip down memory lane. Take a look right here. Oh, man. Did you gain weight last night or something? Look at this photograph. Every time I do, it makes me laugh. It was a wonderful plan devised to steal a plane for a whole day and fly from city to city to city and pick up the people that wanted to party and get drunk and somehow get someone else to pay for it. <laughs> Come sit on my lap. Oh, oh sit, on, sit on our laps. Yeah. Oh, I'd like very a, good. I'd like a Juno for Christmas. Oh. Can I have one of yours? <laughs> yeah. Oh. You devil. You need to start a baby. Hang it up. Oh. Can't get up. Oh, I can't get, get up. <laughs> I went through my phone the other day and your number is still in there. Yeah. Try to get rid of it, or no? I just haven't called you. You'll be like in some sort of really awkward situation. I'll be like, hey, it's Chad. What's going on, dude? And you'd be like, not now. Don't call me. They're all drunk back there. They're all drunk. Yeah. Mission accomplished. Oh, isn't that a nice little trip right there down memory lane? Wow. Yeah. You look exactly the same well, as you did I, I, when you were working on. Uh, <laughs> must have done a lot of work. on this. No, say. I know we're in that business of you know, you know, being plastic and stuff. Yeah. But no, I. Uh, you're in the. I thank my mom you, and dad. You're in the business. Good of jeans. Plastic. Good jeans. No, I did not say that. You know what stays the same though? You guys on each other's laps. He's an action figure all the time. I know. What's up with that? I don't know. You tell me. I don't know. This is you jumped on mine. Comfortability. What I didn't it's, realize it's com is like at some point in time over the years, you've jumped on my lap, uh, me jumping on it's yours. Tradesies. Maybe Trades it has something to do with the the uh, the amount of uh, so soberness, being sober, being drunk. Maybe that had a little. It was a license plane ride. Yeah. What I'm gonna get at though is, you guys are still living like rock stars. You are rock stars. But does it slow down? Do you want it to slow down? Are you have you had enough of the can I tell Fly. a story from last night? You know where I'm going with this. Knock, knock him dead. Knock him dead. Uh, we're, at, uh, we're at a very nice hotel here in <laughs> Toronto, Canada. And uh, we look over, and there's like, there's like 400 glasses on this table. And I look over. <laughs> the only thing that's changed is now we ask before we can break things. We ask before we yeah. just break them. <laughs> I, I look, and Ryan goes, Ryan stands up. This is a father of two. Yeah. And he goes, you know what? I would just like to take my arm and, and just swipe it across this table and break every single glass. You badass. Like, I go, wait, 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 wait. Before that, we should probably speak with the manager. I'm like, responsible. <laughs> yeah. So, he, he, I, I, just to give him his moment, I go, I'll give you three grand. I'll give you 3,000 bucks for the glasses on the table here because my friend was, he goes, just a second. He goes in the back. He brings out all these glasses. He goes, we never use these. And sets up all Set these. He's like, he can, awesome. he can break all yeah. of these. <laughs> this is great. So Ryan stands up and Matrix, <laughs> like no, Neo, no. takes his <laughs> arm. And we're all like, oh, this is great. I'm like, how un-rock and roll is this? When you, when you just try to, but before you break anything, you're like, we should just pay for it. We asked, should we just pay battles. for it first? It's Canadian. Before that's there's funny. any that's that's point. Yeah, and, and, point. And, and he wouldn't take any money. He's just like, just break these. And there were like some incredibly reserved people in, in, in the lounge yeah. of the hotel. Last Ryan takes his arm, <laughs> <laughs> just like smashes everything up. Let's talk about, uh, you know, being married, fatherhood, and all these things that eventually, sooner or later, that's what we want out of life. Creeps into the, into that's what, life. well, that's what it, except they want out of life. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you have, know what I was going with this? Yeah. I, yeah. Where are you going with this? Well, <laughs> sing, sing, single chat, right? That's where I'm going. That's, we're just trying to confirm. Because all the single ladies out there. Didn't, you, the, didn't uh, Daniel, you said it very well. You're like, can you imagine a small version of me loose on the planet? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. <laughs> yeah, it's like, hey, brother, I love you, but if someone clones you, that's, it's, it's not good. Not yeah, good. Yeah, but, but, but the son isn't, isn't always what the father is. There could be a, like, look at Luke Skywalker and Darth Vader. Because he like, ran away, one was far good, away. One was bad. I'm not saying you're bad, Have Chad, you seen The Omen? Have you seen The Omen? Yes, I've seen that if one. If you okay. say that I'm yeah. good, I'm coming over there. I'm not saying that, but I'm saying the, the little Chad won't 
doesn't have to be exactly like the big daddy Chad. Is there a mom in mind, or is there... I, there, there are many mommies in mind. <laughs> Question answered. <laughs> yeah. Question answered. And with that answer, we're letting Thank the fans so take over. That was excellent. Uh, and anything can happen when the fans send in their questions. We're going to take some Twitter questions for the band Nickelback. It's a Nickelback in conversation right here at ET Canada. Welcome back to our very special ET Canada. Spe spe I said special twice now. Is that special. okay? It's not special. Something in that paper cup is just doing things to my Where head right now. Where is the paper cup? It's, 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 don't let him near the paper right. cup. But for, before we get into the Twitter questions, speaking of kids and all this stuff, would you let your kids near this uh, no. gentleman here we call Chad Kruger? No. Yeah. no. Ah, actually, you know what? The, the Mike tells me all the time, he's like, you know what? <laughs> He sees me with his kids, and yeah. he's like, you're going to be a great dad. I'm right. like, yeah, because I get to give them back. I'm like, I love my niece and nephew. Love he's, to death. He is, i got to say, he's good with kids. Yeah. Yeah. He, he, doesn't, he doesn't want them, but he's good with them. So. He also has two yeah. of the most adorable children you've ever seen in your entire life. And, like, they're... And I, I, it, it takes me back. It must do the same thing with you. Like, it must do the same thing with all of you who have children. Yeah, that's... Um, and they're like, yeah, you get to play with G.I. Joe again, and it's okay. I As an the, adult, yeah. yeah. I can wear the water slides and not look stupid now. <laughs> <laughs> Getting in line with all the kids is all weird. Kids hands, Pushing all them back. Right? Listen, yeah, my kid needs to go in front here. <laughs> but I'm in front of him, though. So are those the type of things you're doing, Sue, with your niece and nephew and, and um, Ryan's kids? You're taking them to... Dawson, uh, Mike's oldest son, is now turning out to be quite the little musician. And he's like... Mm -hmm. He can play drums and, oh. and, and bass. Drums, bass, guitar, ukulele. <laughs> really? Piano. Yeah. All that. He does He's everything. very talented. Yeah. Are very you two teaching him, or is he just picking it up like He's Hendrix He's actually up? taking lessons from people like Mick Fleetwood wow. and people wow. of that. How old is um, Dawson? How old is he? He's yeah. 10. Mike's Rolodex wow. is way cooler. I got some, I got some friends who do yeah. things. And Name yeah. dropping in the back there. Yeah. Yeah. Fleetwood. Yeah. I've got Rick Campanelli in my room. Yeah, that's Actually, right. I don't. He won't give me his phone <laughs> no, number. No, no. Yeah, he didn't give me his number. <laughs> you can get it from him if it's still in his oh, phone. Oh, I'll check. Oh, like good. We have some Twitter questions. You guys, do you guys tweet? We tweet. We tweet. We tweet. Yes. We tweet. Can you please say the last form of tweeting on the air? Can you say it? Uh, <laughs> say it. I had to say think it. about that one. <laughs> say it. Hey, almost got you. I almost did that. Uh, let's get right down to it. I think our first question comes from uh, Tammy. Tammy's in Toronto, and Tammy wants to know what is the one item you cannot live without on the road. And then she says something about Jello. Jello? What, is it? Uh, is it Jello? Jello is great, though. It's not knocking Jello, but no. Well, what's I, the one thing I know? Was? Yours. Well, I know that's that's a go-to for Captain us. Captain Morgan. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it always was, comes back was, to alcohol. Yeah, with you I was going to say, I was going to say some of my family on the road at some point, but then yeah. there's Captain Morgan, and sometimes you know how, family, can, how far, can, how far can you make it through the set? Oh yeah, um, before you need a Captain fair, and Coke. Fair enough. Melanie Morrison from Edmonton asks very simply: Any regrets? Not cutting it sooner. Really? Yeah, I should have cut it. Like, should have cut it a long time ago. If that's at the top of their regret list, you're doing all right, dude. <laughs> exactly. I learned to live in the now, and you yeah. can't, you can't do that. I don't do, I don't do, New Year's resolutions. I, uh, I don't what, do any of that kind of stuff. I just you answer the question. And I'm telling you, I don't. Be I specific don't. and stop tap dancing around this. <laughs> I'm trying, to, I'm trying to come up with a better answer than hair. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Well, I can't come up with yours. I came up with mine. Try your best, Ryan. Finish. The hair but is compelling. You're just like, give me one specific thing that you regret. More. I regret this conversation right now. <laughs> right now. With Chad. I regret okay. this. Got it. I regret sitting here. I wish I was back there. <laughs> if he leaves, will you stay? <laughs> Maybe. Talk. Okay, all four of you have to stay because uh, we have some more games coming up. The next one after the break is called Fact or Fake with Nickelback. You do not want to go anywhere. Welcome back to a special edition of ET Canada. I don't want it to end. 
Like, I know you do, <laughs> but I don't, I don't want it to end. Yeah, I, they don't either. Oh, uh, yeah, we're back with Nickelback in our studio, and um, having crazy stories written about you guys, grabbing headlines comes with the territory when you're rock stars, right? So we thought we'd give you guys a chance to set the record straight on a few things, and we like to call this uh, fact or fake. Mm. The, the first one... The best part of this job is not setting the record straight, right? Really. Oh, is that right, Mike? Yeah. <laughs> the lies. So, He's we gotta live in the lies. People know this one, but um, some people may not. The Nickelback uh, name came from, work, Mike, you working at Starbucks and always giving the Nickelback to your yes. customers? Yes. That's... That one's true. That's a fact. Whoa. Next. You were formerly called the Village Idiots? Fact or fake? It, uh, village uh, well, we, we, we never, people, village we were, people. We were never called village, it. Village, yeah. village idiot, singular. Village idiot. Yes. Village idiot. Yes. When you say something like that, please say it right. Chad, you broke into your high school eleven times. <laughs> no, we, we're statute, drinking alcohol. Statute of limitations, statute limitations does not have that. The statute of limitations. So I broke into happened. it as many times as I went to prison for. <laughs> None more. Okay. <laughs> Do not. Ex Fact or fake, did you go to prison? Yeah. Fact, 11 Four. times, fake. Seriously, you spent some time in prison. Yeah, but it was at that Everyone point. Everyone does, right? Kids yeah. prison. Yeah. 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 yeah, it was no big deal. That was One fun. night or I'm more some than... some fun there in Strathmore. What? Was it a singular or was it a plural? <laughs> uh, you know what? It ruined my summer. <laughs> it really, not the it really, put, jail. It really put a damper on my, uh, on my barbecue. <laughs> Being behind bars would do that, especially in the summertime. It's really tough to, <laughs> it's really tough to, to uh, barbecue when you're incarcerated. Thanks uh, for watching ET Canada Conversations, everyone, and thanks so much. Since you're doing the Great Cup this weekend, Mark has a football. Whoever can catch it, oh, you're throwing it to me. No, oh, yeah. throw it to them. Nice. Throw it to them, and whoever gets it, okay, tackle him. Don't, <laughs> ah, don't forget Nickelback's. Blue I'm here now. I'm here now. Good night, everybody.